Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. It is for the privilege and honor for me to be able to uh, share with you what the Lord has laid in my heart. Thank you for really watching my videos. I hope that you watch it till the end. And I'm sure that it will be an encouragement for you. And I pray that the Lord will speak to you through this video today. You know, the last couple of weeks uh, has been a week of, uh, has been weeks of change and growth for me. Though it's not been easy, it's been really hard and I've been learning a lot of things, you know, improving myself and uh, really trusting God and surrendering a lot of things into God's hand for Him to lead me and guide me. And, um, you know, with, with everything that is happening right now in your life, perhaps you are walking through that season or that valley that it's hard, it's painful and, and you're walking through it and you're going through it. And I want you to know that God is a God who sees you and He hears you. All right sometimes it might feel that god is far away from us that he's not listening to our prayers or he's not watching us or he's not seeing us but the reality is he is he is and uh he put he put this message in my heart it's been there for this last couple of weeks and uh i thought i wanted to um you know i wanted to really encourage all those who are watching here today you know a lot of times in life things don't work according to the way we expect them to work sometimes we have planned certain things sometimes the plan you know doesn't turn out and uh sometimes we face failures sometimes we face disappointments and i think that's where the growth really happens you know that's where the, the growth really happens i was watching one of these videos on uh, youtube it was a particular teacher he was talking about a lot of things and he and he particularly said something along these lines and i think it's really inspiring and it's really true and uh, it's really something that uh, you know echoes throughout all our lives in every stage of our lives and i think this is what he said something along this lines he said you know when we succeed you know we celebrate and we party and you know there's a lot, there's a lot of joy and happiness happening which is good you know su success needs to be celebrated success needs to be enjoyed but at the same time when there's a failure when there's a disappointment you know there is this pondering that happens and he said that in that moment of pondering you know greatness comes out of pondering all greatness comes out of pondering and i think that is really really true you know when we fail when we face a disappointment there's a lot of things that happens on the inside of us that we think and you know we pray and we reflect and and then we we realize who we are and you know where we need to be going and we need to understand what's our weakness what's our strength and perhaps you know this whole season of going through this whatever that you're going through you know god wants to reveal certain things in your life god is you know causing you to see certain things in your life that you didn't see before until you know this this disappointment hit you that disappointment you know that that, that painful thing happened well you know the reality is you know god is always doing something new he he changes us right he changes us from the inside out and i think to be we need to be in a position to say god you know use my life help me to deal with the weaknesses that i have in me and you know transform me into the person that you want me to be because ultimately you know our life is his we belong to him and uh, let it be that our life becomes an expression of god in every area of our lives there are things that we could be struggling right now you know things that we no one knows about that that only you on the inside know what you're struggling with but god knows about it and sometimes it's good to share with the people that we trust and pray you know it's good to share what we feel on the inside and uh and i pray that you know it makes all the difference that you that you share with people that you trust and pray for because sometimes you know god speaks through those people that are around us and we want to be in a position to hear god's voice we don't want to be in a position to say you know i want to be um you know fully leaning on my own understanding but i want to be in a position to say god i know that you'll speak through your word the same time you know you'll speak to through your people as well so we need to be open to that as well so today i want to encourage you no matter what you're going through see it as an opportunity to learn to grow to be better and you know let your light shine you know it's i think one of the one of the best things that could happen in your life is to realize who you are sometimes it's painful sometimes it's you know it's not easy to go through that journey but it's worth it and you know and i continue to walk on that journey what it god what god has for me and uh, i'm i'm learning new things and growth is a continuous 
a continuous thing. It, it's just not for a season. You know, it just needs to happen continuously all throughout your life. So I want to encourage you, grow, be better. Let your light shine, be committed. You know, I want to remind you that God sees you, God hears you, and He's beside you. Walk with God daily. Walk with Jesus daily in your life. And, uh, you know, hold on to Him, no matter how difficult, no matter how hard it is. You know, God is always going to show things and guide you, lead you, and empower you, all right? And His faithfulness, His faithfulness never ends. Always remember that. And realize that God sees you and hears you. Those, those two things is really powerful. So I hope that, you know, you're encouraged today. May God be with you and guide you, my friend. Take care and God bless you.